The calendar tool provides a number of layout choices when printing the calendar events. To do this, click on the calendar tab on the nav bar. When you come into the calendar, click on print. The print dialog box will display. There are a number of print options you can choose. The first one is header. In header, you can show the branding, which is checked by default. If I uncheck this option, you want to click update preview and all it's going to do is get rid of that horizontal line. If I keep it checked, I click Update Preview and that always will allow me to see what will, how it will print. The next choices are display options. The Show Events Details is checked by default. If you don't want the event details to be printed, click the checkbox to deselect it and click Update Preview to see how it will print. So you'll see right here I have previews. I click on that I click update preview and all that's going to show me is that and not show me the details. Again it's your choice details are set by default. Uh, checkbox page break before e each event this will place in uh, each individual event on its own page probably not the best option when it comes to printing. The last uh, area is the event range and by default print events between is the default choice and then it will also be set from the day that you're accessing the calendar and out a week. If you want to choose different dates, I can click on the, 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 in the date field, it'll bring up a calendar. I can choose different dates on that and I can choose as many dates as I want and then again click the update preview so that you can get to see what will happen and you'll notice that there's a lot more events that are shown, past events and future events. I also have some other choices in the event range. I can print all events and again click update preview after each one. This will print all the events within my calendar which is a nice feature. If I want to print events prior to, I can print events prior to a specific date and again I can change that date if I want. Print events starting, I can print events starting from a specific date and any events after that event will be shown. After you made your choices and you've updated the preview, then you go ahead and click print. It'll bring up a print dialog box. You choose print uh, for what you for, for printing, choose your calendar, I mean choose your printer. I'm going to just click cancel and when you're all done, just click close.